Oakland County Sheriff's deputies are investigating a quadruple shooting that left three people dead in Pontiac. It happened on Wednesday night at the Spring Lake Village Apartments in the area of Carriage Circle Drive in Auburn Avenue. Rob Maloney joins us now live in Pontiac. And Rod, I know you spoke to one of the victim's sisters just moments ago. Right, and it's devastating for her family. Now, if you look behind me here, you can see some balloons, red balloons, and that is the, uh, the location of the shooting from last night. And uh, the sheriff's department tells us that uh, it, this actually happened as a result of a neighbor dispute. Now, we've got video from last night, and we'll show you um, what the scene looked like then, but we're told that there were four men uh, living uh, in our, our, at an apartment and apparently it was loud, or at least it had been loud, and there were reports that one of the neighbors objected to the fact that since the people had moved in a few weeks ago, that it had been kind of a nonstop party and been very loud. So the woman in the, one of the apartments came out and started talking to the men, and apparently the conversation went sideways. She went back and uh, talked to her boyfriend, who the sheriff's department is telling us came out guns blazing. Uh, gunfire was heard throughout the complex here, and uh, we ended up with uh, four people shot, two dead in their 20s. One, uh, 40 years old, he had died, he died also at the scene. There was one person shot who was in his mid-20s, and he uh, remains in the hospital this noontime. But we spoke to one of the victims, uh, the 40-year-old's sister, and she was genuinely devastated. Her name is Mary Lanehart. Let's hear from her. He was the friendliest guy you ever want to meet. Everybody loved him. Everybody liked him always joking around, always happy with life. And for this to happen, we just lost my cousin and he was so devastated behind that. And now for this to happen to him, it's like a bad dream. It's like a bad dream and it hit close to home. I would, nobody could have told me in a million years this would have happened to my little brother. That, uh, her, her brother wasn't even meant to be there, that he happened to drive by on his way to go pick up some food for the family and ended up talking to these uh, gentlemen on the, on the porch here and uh, that he just happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time when the gunfire erupted. Now, the sheriff's department is in fact investigating, but they do have one person in custody. They say that the person who did the shooting is in, in uh, custody right now. But we're waiting to hear from them. We hope to have a, an interview with somebody from the sheriff's department coming up this afternoon. So reporting live from Pontiac, Rod Maloney, Local 4. All right.